what's up you guys it's your girl Britt and I'm back with another motherfucking video today's a video as you can see in the title down below we're basically gonna be doing just a get ready with me so I don't even have a look prepared or nothing like that but we're gonna try to go for like a summer you know bright pretty bronzy look if you get what I'm saying so with that being said um y'all go ahead and subscribe if you're new because i'm telling you you gonna have fun on this channel <laughs> we all finna have fun on this channel but anyways um hit that subscribe button if you're new and let's get started okay so i did my brows i primed my face already and you guys i want to talk about this primer right here that i used that i never even knew existed but i have great things to say this is the Tarte Base Tape Hydrating Primer. Like, ugh, come on, light. Let them see it. Can you see it now? Anyways, it looks like this, okay? I'm sorry my light's being a bitch. Um, you guys, this stuff right here, it feels so fucking good. Like, it does feel, like, super hydrating, and it's kind of not not really but it's a little bit tacky not too much though but you guys this stuff feels so good and I actually got it out of my what did I get it out of I think I either got it out of my no I got it out of my ipsy bag that's what this came in um, I really don't review my ipsy bag much just because it's just little tiny stuff and I really just rather soak in my time and do a video like this rather than go through like a little bitty bag I do like going through the boxy charms though like I love that y'all know that already um but yeah this stuff is really good and I was shocked that I was getting this so um yeah this is the Tarte Double Duty Beauty Base Tape Hydrating Primer might want to check it out because it seems really fucking good um so uh uh do you guys remember the, um, what was it? Shit, I dropped something. The, my BoxyCharm video, I, um, I couldn't get that fucking artist couture thing. Here it is right here. The, um, Diamond Glow Powder open. I still can't get it open, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Um, but anyways, I really love the Luxie brushes, and I haven't even used them since that video, so... I think I'm going to use them today. So let's go ahead and get into what we're doing. I think the foundation that I want to use today that I haven't used in a while that I really fucking love. Um, I'm going to use the Milani. The Conceal and Perfect 2-in-1 Foundation Concealer. I'm in the shade 02 Natural. I haven't been using it in a while. I don't know why. I don't know. Um, but I am going to get my use out of it before it gets fucking old. So I'm going to take my little Y6 brush right here and I'm going to dab some on. This foundation is really good. Like it used to be it used to be a everyday foundation and now it's just become like a um just whenever I don't know what the fuck I'm going to use foundation. And it sucks because this foundation is really good. So I need to get my usage out of it before the shit fucking gets old or some shit which I don't think it will because it hasn't been that long since I've had it and I think my foundations I think they last for like I'm gonna guess without looking I'm gonna say 6 to 12 months and now I'm gonna grab a foundation and see Okay, so like this elf right here, it says six months. That's not bad. So yeah, I want to use it before. That's the thing when you have so many fucking foundations. It's like you don't even know what to use anymore. And this was my favorite for a long time too. Like it was an everyday foundation. And now it's just whenever I fucking feel like it. But... I was thinking about it last night and I'm like I'm literally just wasting shit at this point 
So, I think I came to a decision that I'm not going to buy any more foundation until I've pretty much gone through what I have. Or it's got to be something really good that comes out or something really good for me to buy it. So, that's that. Um, you guys already know the drill. We're going to pop on concealer. Um, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to use my color pop today. And then um, we're going to get on to these eyes. I have no idea what I'm doing with my eyes. And I'm not really going anywhere. Well, I am. I'm actually going to take my kids out to the park because... This is the only day that I've had off in a long fucking time, and I feel like taking the kids to the park, so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to blend this out real quick, and we will be right. Okay, face has been set and all of that. Um, the bronzer I'm going to use today is this um, Morphe Glam Bronze. You already know what collection this is from, and... This will be, like, the second time using it. This is how it looks if you guys forgot. The plastic just fell out. Um, but, yeah, it has a mirror. It's really cute, and it's fucking huge. But, um, I'm going to use this because, again, shit just sitting around, not being used. And this bronzer is really fucking good. Like, it's super good. And it's affordable, so if you guys want a good bronzer... Check out this one. How was everyone's Easter, by the way? We just went to the park. Um, did the little egg thing. And that was it. And then we ate... And went grocery shopping. <laughs> that was our Easter. So I figured I would take them to the park again because they're bored and there's nothing else to do really. I like to keep my shit in the box, so there it goes, back in the box. But yeah, you guys, definitely try this out if you haven't already. It's really good. I think it's worth it, so, you know. <sighs> now I need some blush. I've been wearing blush a lot lately. I don't know why. I just have. I've been thinking it's super cute. I'm going to take my Um I don't know. I just been into blush lately and I'm not a blush girl at all there's literally some days that I would not wear any if I'm not in the mood this shit's good too check this shit out too okay now into the eyes um I want to kind of play with two palettes um so the first one I'm going to use is the Morphe X Jaff Jaclyn Hill um, this one is the, I don't know because it doesn't say, but it has these shades in it. And I feel like these are perfect shade ranges up here for summertime. Like, perfect. The second one is this little palette by, um, Lime, Lime Crime. Let me get it out so I can show you guys. Um, this is the Fresh Squeezed Plushy Palette. It's really cute. Um, and here's the colors in that. Don't you guys think it's just so adorable? Like, look at it. It's super cute. I like it. Um, so we'll figure out what we'll do with that. Might use some of that pink in here. Um, I don't know yet, but let's get on it. So, um, I'm going to take my little, little Jaclyn Hill palette right here. And I'm going to take this brush and I'm going to put on Transition. really doesn't have a light color. So I'm going to use this one right here. And I'm just going to put that all over the lid. Okay. 
yeah this look I didn't plan this we got that color on now I'm gonna tap in to um <laughs> shit I can't talk I'm gonna tap into this one right here um it's called secure and I'm just gonna focus this on the outer corner I don't know why I've just been kind of doing my eyeshadow like this lately I haven't really been putting like I won't drag the whole entire shade all across my eye I don't know now I want to maybe add some pink from this lime crime palette so I think that's what I want to do I just want to test it out so if it looks ugly I'm sorry but we're gonna use this it is called dragon fruit and I'm just gonna take this little Anastasia brush I'm gonna tap in it. Ooh, it's got um, it's super powdery. Can't say that. And I'm just gonna kind of add it on in. Ooh, I see you. It's pretty. Just mix it on in there. Ooh, this is really pretty. It's got some serious fallout though, but it is like blending perfect. I'm gonna have to clean up like that one little look at this you guys <laughs> I know y'all seen that but that one little like tap in it covered that whole entire so we got you know some orange going on and some pink kind of like the lemonade shit going on that's cute okay now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go back into this one and I'm going to tap into this like yellow mustardy color and I'm just going to go around kind of like this this it's hard to explain I'm just watch <laughs> just keep it like that see if my lighting was like better in here you guys would be able to see every fucking thing every little thing but that is cute I wish I could see it um, I don't know if you could see it let me know if you can or if you can't that yellow that I just popped up so um yeah there's that I need to wipe away that fucking pink down here okay now with the Jaclyn Hill palette again I um I was going to dip into the gold right here, but I kind of want to do this white just because I never really use a white on top of my eye. Um, so I'm going to use that instead of gold today, and I'm just going to pack that on in right there. Ooh, it's pretty. Just like that. It went on good too. Okay. Okay, so we got the eyes finished. Um I'm not wearing lashes today because I've been wearing lashes literally almost every fucking day. Um, but I put some of that pink from the Lime Crime on the lower lash line and I think it looks really fucking cute. So now we gotta move on to highlighter. Um, I'm gonna use this Cover FX, the Glitter Drops, just because, you know, in the summertime we wanna be looking nice and bronzy and gold, you know, we wanna look cute and plus this is another product that's just sitting so I'm just gonna take one two three like that and then same on the other side one two three well yeah like that and then I'm gonna put some on my nose oh, sorry here and now I'm just gonna take my little highlighter brush and I'm just gonna kind of or let me take a a beauty sponge first this stuff is fucking intense like for real 
Let's see what my brush can do with it. Ooh, it's so pretty, but you gotta be careful with stuff like this because, like, you know, you don't want to put too much on, you know what I mean? And then look fucking crazy, so I actually like it better with the brush instead of the sponge. This stuff is fucking intense. Um, just blend it on my little nose right here. <laughs> you see, you guys, this stuff is intense as fuck. <laughs> it's a lot on my cupid's bow, but whatever. Y'all see it? Okay. Now we're going to go over it with the Wet n Wild right here. This is like the gold, a golden flower crown, that's what that's called. And we're going to go over it with this just to kind of set it in good. Woo, and this is even more intense. I'll be wearing this shit for real in the summertime. A little bit right here. We are nice and highlighted. Damn. Okay. Um. Now I need to set my face. You see, I put everything back in the box. It's just a habit of mine. I don't know why. I guess because I like to have the feeling of it still being new. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Okay, I'm going to set my face. So, I'm going to take the Morphe setting mist right here and just set my face really good. Okay. Now I'm going to do something with my hair. I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do. Probably just keep it up like this to be real. Um, I'll be right back and we will end this video. Alright you guys. Um, I really didn't know how I wanted to wear my hair. But I thought this was cute. Um, you know. I really love the look we got going on on the eyes. Um, I think it's really cute for summertime. And then the highlight. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. Um. No words to describe the highlight. But, this is it for today's video, you guys. Like I said, I just wanted to do a little get ready with me. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you beautiful people on the next video. Bye, loves.